Till this time, uh, I, I see you as Desardo pa rin. <laughs> Desardo pa rin? Yes. Yeah. Grabe yung character mo doon. You know what's the hardest part is to drop that character mm-hmm. because I love them so much. Mm-hmm. I, I love that character so much, Desardo. Mm-hmm. Like, I, I love them. I, I live that. I live mm-hmm. in the shoes of that character. Mm-hmm. And the hardest part now is to let go. Yeah. <laughs> But naka move naka na, na let go mo na ba yung character mo si Lizardo? I'm doing new movie now. I'm, I'm, may bagong pelikula now with Mam Charo and Bello. Iri, so, tama yeah. ba? So I have to let go of that and Carlos. come up come up with something new. And, and yeah, Michael Red, Michael Red, Michael Red. The director like he submitted the script to a Korean film festival and it's part of the whole like, Korean film festival. Ah, uh, so doon siya magpipremiere? Yeah, so I'm doing a movie with Moncharo and then we are not. And Mikael Red. Ngayon, with Eli, as your role as Carlos, ano, would you say na you were able to let go of the character of Carlos? I've let go of it for months now. Like, mm-hmm. I mean, like honestly, like it's very uncomfortable for me to be here. Like, it's very uncomfortable for me to be here because I've let go of the Carlos oh. song for months. Mm-hmm. Parang, parang, when me and Gerald did our last scene together, I was just like, huh. Oh. I'm done. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. Masasabi ba itong karakter mo si Carlo? Uh, close sa'yo? Kasi since it's a uh, triathlon, a uh, triathlete din siya. Well, no, I, I'm a triathlete. I'm mm-hmm. sure. But uh, I think like, one, one thing I benefited out of the show was being, a, being an athlete. Mm-hmm. Like, kung, kung hindi dahil sa show na ito, I would have never been an athlete. I would, I would have been in a different lifestyle. Different, mm-hmm. you know, you know what I mean? Like a different, different mode. Mm-hmm. Uh, because of the show, uh, I changed my life. Mm-hmm. You've been doing contrabida roles since uh, tayong dalawa ba? Tayong dalawa? Parang may time ba na nagsasawa ka na sa mga role as contrabida or as mga dark roles? No, contrabida roles for me, I, I, I've done lead. I, a year ago, I was doing Fashion Day Amor. Yes. And um, people love me in that show, and then people hate me here. Mm-hmm. But honestly, like I think, like when I do contrabida roles, it's liberating. Mm-hmm. I, I like it. I can mm-hmm. be myself. I think like the contrabida roles, the mga contrabida na role, I think it's what's closer to what a real person is in real life. That's why I think like parang lahat naman tayo. We have flaws. We have flaws. A lot of flaws. Marami tayong ginagawang mali. Mm-hmm. That's the truth. Mm-hmm. And I think when I do contrabida role, I think it's... I feel like it's it's more real. Mm-hmm. I don't think there's a real martyr in real life unless yes. you want to be a martyr. Especially this time. So for me, like when I do the contrabida roles, I think it's more closer to home. During the whole, parang more than a year of doing Carlos, parang when you go home, dala mo siya? Or are you the type that when you go home, I am Jake again? Yeah, I've been acting for 15 years. I know, I know how to let go and I know how to, I know, I know how to do my, I know how to do my thing. So like, um, I think Lizardo was more the one that I didn't want to let go of because I was so like... So you! I, I was so into it, like, you know, rock star. Yes. Rock star. Tsaka yung outfit. Panalo yung mga ano. The, the, the Carlos role was more, was more... It was easy to just let go. Pagka-cut, pag, pag nag-cut na yung director, it was easy for me to let go. <laughs> Okay, ngayon lang, if you will, if you're going to have an ex- your next project and you can conceptualize your character or anything in mind that you want to pitch. No, I'm doing, I'm, I'm, honestly, like, I, 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 I was reading the script to my next movie mm-hmm. with Mang Chang and Bea, and honestly, like, mind blown. Mm-hmm. I was like, shh, like, pardon my French, like, I was like, shit, this is the one. Uh-huh. After Lizardo, this is the next logical step for me like this is the one so like when I was reading the script I was reading the script I was in a bar drinking drinking in the bar and then reading the script and then and my, my mind was blown away like, and then I called the director I'm like 
and then I called Jimmy and I said like I'm doing this movie, 110 percent I'm doing this movie. Mm. And then I told my I told my manager too. Uh, I told Star Magic uh, be- right before I accepted this movie. And I said like after Lizardo I wanna be selecting. Like, I, I don't wanna accept just any roles anymore. I don't wanna uh, just do anything. Mm. And then the script came and I was my mind was blown over here. And then I said I'll drop for a last. <laughs> Are you sorry, pre- I have to say like 2018 is looking like, very good. I'm oh, sorry. Are you pressured to work with Mam Charo? Or since it's... Uh, no, no, I think like, no, that's the thing. That's how you lose. Mm-mm. If you're like... That's how you lose. If you're so pressured into like... You know, like you work with big stars or whatever. That's how you lose the scene. Yeah. It's when you're like, oh wow, uh, it's Mam Charo and I can't do things. Mm-hmm. And, like you're being... Scared of the person. No. Have you always been this confident, or did you develop it as a? No, I learned it from Ivana Chabok. Like um, definitely, like she told. Like I mean, when I was studying under her, she told me like. That's how you lose scenes. Like maybe you're doing a scene with the biggest actor ever, and then you feel. Um, you feel lower than the person, or you feel like you're un. Unsuper- inferior. Yeah, no, that's the word. Inferior. That's how you lose the scene. Mm-mm. The the villain is always at par with the lead. You know what I mean? Every time I do a role, every time I do a role, it's my story to tell. Like to my to my to my knowledge, this is my story to tell to you people. You know what I mean? Like. That's how that's how like small actors become small actors. It's when they start to accept the fact that they're mas malit sila dun sa bida or mas ah wala support lang ako dito. That's how you lose. Thank you. That's how you lose. So like for me, like no matter who I'm with, I can be in the scene with Ryan Gosling right now and feel as confident as a, you know, I feel as confident like you know, like, you know, like, you know, like, you know, like, I'll know for fact. I have something to give to the table. And that's my take with Mamchai. Also, they were asking me about it too. Like how, how do you feel about uh, being sales with Mamchai? To me, she's just another actress. Thank she's another actress that I'm doing a scene and then we're trying to create a scene here. You know what I mean? But, Sana, like, I mean, Sana, like, other actors, like, other actors who are starting, don't ever, da- don't ever accept the fact that you're, s- you're just a lead, or you're just a supporting lead, you're the best friend. But at the end of the day, like, Whatever role you do, whatever role you do, you're the lead of your story. Because you mentioned Ivana Chaba, so you think you mga principles you learned from her, not only sa acting, is it, or are they also applicable to your life? May mga applicable to your concepts siya sa life acting is my life. You know? like, I, mean, I, I, I live for this. I live for this. This is, this is what I love to do. Whether to make you love me or to make you hate me, I, I'm, I'm gonna get a reaction from you, 110 percent. But then, like, I mean, things like with going back to like small roles and big roles, like whatever role you have. And that's what Ivana Chabok will teach you. Like she'll tell you, like whatever, even if you're an extra in a movie, at the end of the day, when you enter that scene, that's your story to tell. Every scene that is, you know. So like for me, like you know, often, often like a lot of actors come up to me and ask me for advice, how how I do, what I do. And I just tell them, like, whatever your role is, whether it's small or big, or whether best friend kind of be that or whatever that is, it, you have to always look at yourself as the lead. Even as contrabida, you can't say, oh, contrabida ako dito. To my knowledge, I'm the lead here. Okay, thank you. That's how, that's how you make it happen. Thank you so much. Thank you.